Ow. Guys, it's been a minute since I vlogged. And the reason is because I'm stressed out of my mind. And today, I want to talk to you about why. Well, the biggest reason I'm stressed. And let's be honest, I don't have a lot to be stressed about. My life's pretty dang good. But that being said, you still have stresses in life. And mine right now, I put an offer in on a house. Now this is a cool house I've been looking to build. This one just jumped out at me and I've been looking for the last six months to make like St. George my home. I've moved every year for the last 14 years. So I'm like, I wanna put down some roots in St. George, Utah. My gym's here, I like it here. Got the boat, got the, the, the family here. So, submitted this offer in on this house. I've been filling out paperwork just stacks and stacks of paperwork with my signature on them. Like really, that's that's a lot of paperwork for a house. Um, I'm gonna talk to my realtor today. Uh, I'm gonna go look at a different house to kinda get a ballpark estimate of if there's anything else out there. And I have to go take my dog to the vet. So let's go get Poppy. Poppy, dad's coming for you. Just pretend you're playing a role in the videos. Yeah, let me know it's coming then. It's coming. Hey! It's coming. <laughs> Is this a vlog video? This is a vlog. Alright, can I get in this vlog real quick? Yeah, get in the vlog. Alright, they need to know a couple things about me. Okay. Number one, resting bitch face. All the time. Alright? Just Jake's an asshole. Deal with it. Or, I mean, it looks like he's an asshole. He's the nicest yeah, guy in the world. No, I've been told a million times, like, no shit. People that become my friends are like, man, when I first met you, I thought you were such an asshole. I bet everyone in their, on the history of anyone who's ever met you has thought that at the beginning. Like, you're intimidating dudes. You're like, we freaking look like Mr. Incredible. Yeah. Then, and then my then, next thing is like, oh, well, did we, did we like talk to each other? And they're like, no. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> so you just think I'm a fucking asshole. You just looked at me. Yeah. Well, big, would like, I, would you be scared of a silverback gorilla two, in the wild? Number two, I want people to know. I can't hit high pitches. I'm monotone. Because uh, my vocal cords got fucked up because I was running. I was training for the CrossFit Games in 2016. It was like 106 every day in Salt Lake City. And... The pollution was like really, really bad, like real bad. And I was running out there every day, and then I lost the ability to go to just make any other it. pitch than <laughs> make any other pitch than we, what's coming out of my mouth right we, now. We just try to hit it. <laughs> no, nothing comes out. <clears throat> really? Yeah, if I try to like talk to my dog or a baby, like, like a poppy voice. <laughs> poppy. Nothing comes out. Nothing. Nothing. All right. So, so that's why. Hey, hey don't hey, think so just because you can't hit a high note, he's the dick. Yeah, just because if you think I'm, I'm, I'm always in a good mood. All right. I'm always ready to go. I'm always in a good mood. This is the only thing in life that de-stresses me. Poppy! Oh, hi. Aww. What are you doing right now? I'm going to take Poppy to the vet. Hi, Susan. Yeah, you are. Babe, we have to film a YouTube. I haven't been filming YouTube because I've been stressed out of my mind with the house. Don't post me. I look so bad. And then so Courtney's bad. been sick. You guys, I'm hi. sick. I have stress. Wait, why are her eyes red? Have you guys been smoking weed? <laughs> No, she always hides under. You guys don't film me. I'm dying. Are you right ready now. to go to the vet? 145 is your appointment? Yeah. Do you need anything? Do you need a hug? She honestly, she sleeps in her bed. I thought I was she never does. gonna be a person covers. that allowed their dog to sleep in their bed, but you're just so freaking cute. Do your meow. So guess what? Dad's taking you to the vet. Let's go to the vet. <laughs> Let's go to the vet. Now, if it's for your company, for promotional stuff, like, you know, saying, like, this is the people that I've worked with, that's fine. Got it. I, 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 I totally see your... Let's go see, Let's go see if my little girl's a soldier. Okay, stay there. That's a good girl. 10 pounds, eight ounces. Stay, no, you gotta stay put. No, you gotta stay put. Ten pounds, six ounces. I've been here way too much. Freaking Frenchies are expensive dogs, but they're so worth it. They're so worth it. Oh, my pouch just dropped her out of my arms. Babe, we would have been right back in there with a broken leg again. All better? Is being synced. Well, what we need to get her is like a really bougie car seat that goes in the middle. They make them. 
because I know I probably shouldn't be driving with a dog on my lap. I mean, people do it out there, but like Jake, Jake was saying, he, could, he couldn't hit that high voice. Watch <laughs> when I hit this high voice. Poppy! Hi, Poppy! She's like, what the hell? Jake can't hit that high voice. All right, so we're now gonna stop in real quick. I was talking to my realtor and look at this other house. I just need to have a, a second option on a house. So I'm gonna check this one out. Hello? Kind of dope, it would be like a courtyard area. Sliding door, so you walk in, sliding door, upstairs. Kitchen, living room area. Did you see the other house? Mm -hmm. Oh, no, 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 not, not this new one. The one that I put an offer in? Yeah, I haven't seen it yet. What do you think of this place? It's kind of, it has an interesting floor plan, but it feels spacious. I like the little courtyard area there. There's a ton of light too, that's kind of nice. Yeah, but big windows, like... tall ceilings. Yeah, it does have tall ceilings. So I am a stress eater. When I have a lot going on, Courtney, you can probably attest to this. Yep. I just, I eat whatever's around me. This is what's around me. But I'm not eating it because I'm eating this because Courtney has been prepping my meals today, starting today. today. This is chicken, rice, some veggies, and about 30 grams of an avocado mitt. So thanks, Court. Welcome, Thanks, Mom, for the pie. Which, when I stress eat, I will definitely be smashing that lemon meringue pie. I'll ask you a question. How is her lemon meringue pie? It's amazing. What do you tell your mom? Thank you, Mother. Yeah, welcome, Jay. We're cutting your hair here soon, too, just to let you know. Don't you be stressing me out, too, okay? Be nice to your mom. Love you, Mom. Is that mine? It's really a little piece. Can you want, can you have a bigger piece than that? Well, a Here's little a piece. piece. No, a little piece is probably a, a good thing. I cut a bigger piece, and then I said, if I give that bigger piece to Stephen, and Jason's really gonna go, what the heck? <laughs> <laughs> I got plenty. Plenty, plenty. Hey, do you want some pie too? Too bad. You're a dog. She doesn't know that. Oh, look at that. This yeah, is stress like, relief 101. Like, you know what else is stress relief 101? This. Yeah, this is my de-stress. Getting out to the lake, 86 degrees. Got the boys, this is fellow's trip. We got my man Trav here. What's up? We got Jack Attack in the Nebraska hat that someone gave me at the gym that I let Jack borrow when he stole from me. And then we got Mr. TJ Green. Look at that, supporting the Jazz because they won last night. And Jason behind the camera. I'm here too. about to relieve some stress. It's a little windy out here. We ain't getting, we ain't letting that get us down though. Your boy, I'm learning how to drive a boat, you know? I'm on a boat and it's going fast and... We ready? Kick your butt! It's pretty choppy out there. This is my younger brother. He's tried this one other time. Come on, man, you got it, dude! Positive affirmation! You ready? Okay, ready. 
No, I'm not ready! <laughs> oh, no. About to leave. Already packing. Come with me. I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. Boating was just, just what I needed. But we're back in the office today, and lo and behold, Gymshark comes. Got the new Onyx Imperial long sleeve hoodie. Um, that's that's the Black Panther outfit. This thing is what I'm really excited about. This is the Breathe Tank. This thing isn't even out yet. I'm gonna put a, a link in the description for Gymshark stuff. I think I'm gonna need to go try this on. So I'm gonna be right back. Boom. I like, I'm digging the side. That right there is the little details and things. So, and guys, I'm sorry that my stuff is out of stock. I had no say in how much of it was created. So when it went that fast, I was surprised that it's not gonna be a restock, but there might be a version 2.0. So this one, obviously a little bit longer. We're gonna see what else we got. Here's a Breathe t-shirt. This looks pretty sick too. Now this stuff isn't out yet, because your boy gets them before. And they gotta make sure everything's good. Oh, that's nice too, though. Oh, that's nice. All right, let's go try this on. Yo, this one, I can get down with this too, especially because I didn't have, I don't, I'm not training arms today. So I'm not trying to show my arms right now. Longer in the back, a little bit different material. This is a little bit more breathable than this. I see you, Gymshark, doing your thing. Let's see what else we have here. This is a Breathe t shirt, extra large. So in the tank, they sent me the large, and then this stuff, they sent me the extra large. I gotta make sure. Oh, never mind, Guys, I'm sorry. This was an extra large tank. So I'm six foot, six foot one, uh, 215 pounds right now, and wearing. That's pretty, I like the color on this. This is more of like a sandstone color. So this is called a washed beige. Sounds so, so nice. What do you think, Jason? What shirt should I rock today? We're gonna go well, work out. So you're not doing arms today? I'm still gonna do this one. All right, one more <laughs> change. This, this is what I'm rocking today, the short sleeve, because it's it's not arm day, it's chest day. So, this material is definitely different stuff than Gymshark's ever used. I love that breathable back. All right, I'll see you guys. Um, and like always, um, I'll be in Birmingham, Birmingham, no, Birmingham, for the same time Body Power's going on, but I won't be at Body Power. I'll be at the Gymshark event. But this is what I'm rocking today. All right, me and my new Gymshark tee, I'm about to go hit a chest session. All right, you guys coming, let's go. Uh, I know we said we we're gonna go lift. I was down there just warming up. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but every time I, I warm up using like a ring, you know, do if I'm doing ring rows, or if I go to pick something up and set it down, this bicep just gets shooting pain, and this is part of my frustration. I feel like I'm just not healthy right now. I feel like I can't get healthy. I feel like I'm getting shrinking by the day because I haven't been, I haven't gotten through like a full-fledged workout. So I think I just need to get to the doctor and, and see what's going on. Do full, full physical. Not feeling like myself. I don't know if it's stress or you know things like this just keep happening. This has been going on for like two, three weeks. So I wish I was gonna come and say, hey, you know, I got through this workout and I felt great. Can't even do a workout. So what do you do when what you expect out of life and the reality of life isn't matching up? That's what I'm going through right now. What I want, what I expect, and what I'm trying to vision in my head for me personally isn't happening right now. That's a very frustrating place to be in. So if any of you guys are going through that stuff, I can sympathize with you. And I guess the, the idea is you just gotta stay positive with the belief that it's going to get better. So, boo to wrap up this video. I wish I had a cool way of wrapping this up with a cool workout montage, but you know what? Right now in life, this is what we got. This is what you gotta deal with, so you can either pissed off about it, which I am, but I'm also gonna do something about it. So, we're gonna go get it checked out. I need a full physical. That's what we're gonna do next week. Take you guys with us to go get a full physical. All right guys, I'm out of here. At least my shirt's cool. Thanks for watching.